All right, greetings everyone. Mr. Ron Mac here. It's way in day, and way I, way in I did. Um, it's kind of sad because this was the um, you know the first week of the no beer contest, so I had absolutely no beer all week long, and I was expecting you know good results, and I weighed in this morning and. Lo and behold, I was at 238 even. Again, the same exact thing I weighed last last week. So, I mean, I've been sitting in this ballpark for three weeks now. Uh, the, you know, two weeks ago, or whatever it was, two weeks ago, I weighed in at 237.9 or 0.8 and then 238. So, you know, I'm stuck. I'm going to have to do something. I really thought the um, no beer thing would shake things up. And it's not like I went crazy and cheated on my diet. I, I stuck really struck this week because uh, I was expecting that with the aid of the no beer thing, I would, you know, roll roll over for two or two or more pounds. But I don't know. No such luck, I guess. I'm going to have to think about it and come up with a... Uh, a new diet plan. <clears throat> I don't know, because everything I'm reading about weight loss plateaus says you have to shake up the system. Um, I don't know, fasting is not great for your health, but I think maybe for, I don't, I don't know, a limited basis or something, I'm going to have to uh, crunch, crunch some numbers and see what I think about it. But Obviously what I'm doing right now is not working i mean any longer i've went down what so far 33.6 pounds yeah 33.6 total but i'm just stuck right now so i'm gonna have to uh, reinvent again i don't know may maybe i need to just take a week off of uh working out because i really 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 ran hard this week um and I might have overtrained. I don't know. I'll think about it. I'm going to have to make some sort of adjustment next week. And then we'll see where we go from there. In other news, <laughs> apparently the uh, no beer competition's over. He tapped out already. Just quit. That's, um, that's how the day went. It's understandable, I guess, because um, he's really no match for my powers of psychological warfare over text message apparently you know just just pushed him over the edge it's all my fault at least that's what I gathered it was pretty much all my fault um, I made him drink and I could tell you he's drunk now because I just got back from a walk with uh, young fuzzball and he's uh, you know texting me off the hook that he wants to Skype and he only really does that when he's right pissed and it's what six seven seven so it's about two in the morning there i think he should be sleeping but now he's awake drinking all the beer in denmark because after six days he was incredibly thirsty and i haven't decided what i want to do yet um honestly i was mentally set to go the four weeks but i don't think i should torture myself now that i've won Maybe I'll just go buy a beer. I think I will. Maybe not, though. I think I will. I mean, it's only 6.45, right? No sense torturing myself. It's really hot today. And let me tell you, uh, last week, oh, Tuesday or something, I mowed the lawn. And it really makes me sad to mow the lawn and not be able to have a beer when I'm done. It's depressing. I don't know. One thing I did notice about the concession video was uh, you did not address me as your lordship or um, his honorable victor or anything. And I think being that you lost, I thought that was a condition. Maybe you don't remember agreeing to it, but um, I did win. And you lost because you're weak and you quit. And I haven't quit yet. I'm thinking about it, but... I don't know. I'd ask what you think, but 
by the time anyone commented, I'll have made up my mind. And I'm leaning towards quitting as well because obviously it doesn't help me lose weight. And um, what would the point of torturing myself be? I don't know. Leave your thoughts, though. And, you know, congratulate me on my victory because uh, I won and you lost. Catch you later.